Hi everybody, this is Gordon. We are uh, going through a problem set on evaluating algebraic expressions. This is problem number one, and problem number one is find z, uh, z being equal to three times the quantity x plus y, all divided by two, when x is equal to five and y is equal to minus two. Substituting the values in, we get z is equal to three times the quantity five plus a negative two, all divided by two. 5 plus minus 2, or negative 2, is the same as 5 minus 2. That is 3. So our value then becomes 3 times 3, all divided by 2. That, of course, is equal to 9 divided by 2, or 4 and 1 half. And that's it. Hello, everybody. This is Gordon. We're doing problem number 2 in a set of evaluating algebraic expressions here. We're asked to find z when z is equal to 1 divided by x minus y minus 1 divided by x plus y when x is equal to 3 and y is equal to 2. When we substitute the values that we have into the equation, we get z is equal to 1 over 3 minus 2 minus 1 over 3 plus 2. 3 minus 2, of course, is equal to 1, so you have 1 over 1 minus 1 over 3 plus 2 is 5. Making the denominators the same here, multiplying this by 5 over 5, we get 5 over 5 minus 1 over 5, which is equal to 4 over 5. And that's it. Thank you. Welcome back. This is the third problem in our first set of evaluating algebraic expressions here. We are asked to find z when z is equal to the quantity 4xy divided by 3x plus y, all added to 5 when x is equal to 1, y is equal to minus 2. Substituting our values in, we have z is equal to 4 times 1 times negative 2, divided by the quantity negative 2 plus 3 times 1. When we multiply out, 4 times 1 times negative 2 is negative 8, 3 times 1 is 3, add that to negative 2. We get 1, and we'll bring down the plus 5, of course. And when we do, our expression becomes negative 8 plus 5, which is equal to negative 3. And we're done. Thank you. Hello, everyone. This is problem number 4 in our first set of algebraic expressions. Here, we're trying to find w when w is equal to the quantity x squared plus y squared divided by 2z plus z divided by the quantity x minus y when x is equal to minus 2, y is equal to 2, and z is equal to 4. Substituting our values in, we find that w is equal to negative 2 squared plus 2 squared all divided by 2 times 4. To that, we add 4 <coughs> divided by negative 2 minus 2. Negative 2 squared is 4. 2 squared is 4. Add those two together. You get 8. 2 times 4, of course, is 8. We add to that 4. Negative 2 minus 2 is negative 4. 8 divided by 8 is 1. 4 divided by minus 4 is negative 1. Negative 1 plus negative 1 is equal to 0. Ah, hello everybody, this is Gordon again. This is problem number 5 on our first set of solving algebraic expressions. And here we're asked to find w when w is equal to the quantity x plus z squared divided by y minus the quantity x times y divided by 2 when x is equal to 2, y is equal to 8, and z is equal to 10. Substituting the values that we have, we find that w is equal to 2 plus 10 squared divided by 8 minus 2 times 8 all divided by 2. 2 plus 10 is 12. Squared is 144. So we have 144 over 8 minus 16 divided by 2. To get a common denominator, we can multiply this by 4 over 4, and we find we have 144 divided by 8 minus 64 divided by 8, which is equal to 80, divided by 8, which is equal to 10.